Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do your daily vibes for, well, what is today anyway? Today is the 21st, 22nd, so the tr Friday to Saturday, okay? Um, we're just going to see whatever comes up. You know, I like to focus on love, so we'll, we're going to get one of these this time. Maybe two, just be, I don't even know why, just because that's what I think I need to do. So that's what I'm going to do. <laughs> Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. There could be some flirting going on right now. There probably is. Um, and this is probably saying, you know, go for it. Don't hold back. Don't hold back. One more card. This is for all signs. If this reading makes you feel confused, then it's probably not for you. Separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Maybe because somebody's flirting <laughs> with somebody else. I mean, that could be the case. Nobody likes that shit, right? So, who knows? I know I don't. I don't like to see my man flirting with another woman. That's a no-no. So, who knows? Friday, Saturday. Something may be delayed. Something is probably delayed, stalled. Ooh, <laughs> what about, let's talk about contradictions for a minute, okay? So we have this big old contradiction, then we have this big old contradiction. So we definitely got some adversity here. Something may have been delayed, you know, and the way I see it, I mean, take a look at this, okay? So, I mean, it's pretty interesting. This is pretty interesting because... You know, perhaps something has been delayed because somebody need to sep needed or needs to separate from a situation. That could certainly be the case. And maybe there's some feelings or some tug in a new direction and you're being called to take action. You know, just saying. It's pretty interesting. Yeah, it is. I mean, they fit. They totally fit. So I think that there's probably, you know, you're being called to take action instead of instead of instead of holding back. Maybe you've been scared. Maybe you've been delaying, holding on to something, and you really are being called to get your ass in gear. You know, why 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 are you holding back? Now, <laughs> we have an earth sign and a fire sign. Earth sign tends to go very slow, very, very slow. Then we have this fire sign that says, let's, let's get, I'm ready to rumble. I'm ready to rumble here. So, I mean, there's definitely an imbalance. <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely an imbalance in this situation. So, um, is a complex decision on the table. Is this the option? What option should I take? Oh my goodness. I'm afraid, I'm afraid to make the wrong choice here. But there's a new door opening, okay? There's a new path. Somebody's at a crossroad. Do you stay stuck? Do you stay in this place of separating yourself from making a decision, separating yourself from... Uh, making a decision. Do you stay in this spot of separation? It could be separation from anything. Or do you go through that new door and allow something to grow? Do you allow this new beginning? I mean, what are you going to do? You have to make a decision here. You know, I think that somebody is trying to keep themselves safe by separating themselves from a situation. Stalling. Okay. Yeah. 
I'm just going to style this to protect myself, right? To protect myself. But there's an opportunity for something very passionate and exciting to to blossom if you can look at it look at this in a lighthearted way instead of a instead of a way of I need to protect myself you know I can't I can't allow this you know that thing so tight that I can't even barely move it um, somebody is doing themselves an injustice yeah an injustice by not knowing what they what they want you know I don't I don't know what I want I don't know what I want you know, on one hand, I want stability, I want abundance, I want security, you know, I want it all on one hand, I, you know. On the other hand, I am afraid to step outside of my comfort zone, okay. On the other hand, I'm afraid to let you in. Um, it feels as though there's an opportunity here to, to complete one cycle. Seriously, okay, we have these two cards. There's an opportunity to complete that cycle of worry. To complete that cycle of stress, to to let the the period of struggle that you have been going through that has caused so much imbalance in your life, there's an opportunity to free yourself from that. There is at this point to remove the obstacle of your negative thinking, of your you know fears, of your your mental conflict you can remove those obstacles you can come out of this this state of of turmoil this mental turmoil whenever you want you can you just have to make the decision to do so okay you can you can choose to um open yourself up or you can choose to be worried about it for the rest of your life and and you know treat yourself unfairly i mean it's up to you you have an opportunity at this point to perhaps join together with somebody go down a new path but you're very iffy very very iffy so I see a lot of um, thinking about is this the right option should I should I go I mean should I allow there's definitely a choice on the table here, definitely, and maybe maybe you're you're afraid to. Well, I see that you are afraid to allow. I'm afraid of to allow, and it, and it's like you're 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 just really not giving something a chance when it feels as though you're being called to. You're, you're being called to just go with the flow. Free yourself from thinking that you don't deserve it. Because I think that's part of this as well. Somebody feels like they don't deserve this opportunity, this, this chance for stability it's like I don't I don't deserve it so I'm just going to protect myself by not moving forward even though I do want to move forward but but I don't I, you know I'm, I'm not worthy I'm not worthy and you need to let go of those thoughts let go of the thoughts that you are not worthy because you are worthy I feel like this is this is liberation freedom from the negativity that you've held on to okay 
break free of that. Break free. I mean, he's tied. Break those chains of negative thinking. You're only doing an injustice by yourself by, by not making the decision to move on from that, them thoughts. Somebody probably has an opportunity for love here to fall in love. I just keep looking at this card right here. Somebody does. Somebody has an opportunity, but really, really a scared, really, really a scared, really, really scared to get themselves involved in a karmic situation. You know, I'm not, I don't, if I could prevent myself from from getting hurt, that would be great. That would be really nice. But, and it's safe to do that. It's safe to delay this because then I don't have to worry about getting hurt. But there's consequences for staying in that safe zone. And you know what that consequence is for staying in that safe zone? Loneliness. Okay? So anyway, there is an opportunity. There's like a new door. There's a, there's a door that has opened, okay? It's like the universe has shown some shown you that door, okay? The door is, is there. The gate is open. You are you have that opportunity to walk through. You do. All you have to do is decide to take those steps. Oh, jeez. So, um... And I think somebody is really imbalanced with the choice that they have to make. They don't know. They're very, con I mean, these, these are both imbalance. You know, and it's like the time is now and you have to make a decision. You have to make a decision right now. I mean, that's what it looks like to me. You have to make a decision right now. And there will be consequences for your choice of the decision that you make. Okay. Either you stay where you're at and you, and you stay imbalanced and you know, unhappy and pretending that everything is okay when everything is not, or you can go, you can go down that new road. You have an opportunity to go down that new road. Here we have the queen of pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is about being practical. Grounded. You have to make a decision, like I said. You need to make it based on your own security. And that's what's happening here. I'm trying to keep things secure. I'm trying to keep things stable. Yeah, okay, that's interesting. So I, <laughs> oh. so I fear, I fear that I don't really want to get into a situation that is not balanced where I will be treated unfairly. Somebody is trying to protect themselves because of the, of being in a, in a situation that was imbalanced. I mean, these are both imbalanced. It's like, this is stalled because I'm trying to protect myself from getting involved with anybody who is just going to shut themselves down. Now, this person is, is shut down emotionally. This person is not. This is ungrounded. This is grounded. So we have a woman that is really afraid of unfair treatment. 
This is unfair treatment. And here we have liberation, freedom. Oh my goodness gracious. This is freedom. Break the chains because there's a chain. Break the chains from whoever this person is. Looks like a man to me. Break the chains to from this person who didn't treat them fairly. Didn't give. Didn't give. Didn't put in effort. Didn't want to be held accountable for their actions. And this person, this person, whoever the other person is, has been stuck holding on. And that's why we have separation and flirt. Somebody is being called to separate from a situation, remove this obstacle, take at, at now, think later, because there's an opportunity for security and stability being offered to you if you can step out of your fears and stop trying to protect yourself. Hmm. Listen to your intuition. Somebody knows what they need to do in regards to this choice that needs to be. There's a choice. There's a decision here. Do you stay stuck? Do you keep protecting yourself? Do you keep holding yourself back? Or do you actually take action and, and flirt? You have to separate. So the separation needs to truly happen from whoever it was that didn't love you unfortunately, because this person doesn't have good intentions in reverse, okay? There's a person that didn't follow through here. And now there's a new opportunity for security and stability in which you are being called to go for it. Go for it. But you're going to have to truly separate, fr separate your feelings, your thoughts, your fears, from the situation that was caused by another human being who has brought a lot of mental turmoil into your life. Maybe they involved you in a third party situation. Perhaps. They, they talked the talk, but they didn't walk the walk, right? So I feel like somebody has been holding on to hopes of a reunion with somebody that didn't love them. Here we have a reunion. Now they have come to the, to the terms that, you know, this person is never going to talk the talk. This person is never going to follow through. And I, it's, it's really time for me to remove this obstacle. Or this is the obstacle. Remove this obstacle. Stop lying to myself. Listen, listen to my inner being. It's time for me to, to really start listening instead of being in denial. So I, anyway, I feel like there is an opportunity for, for something. Somebody is like coming into your life and wanting you to take action with them but the fears in the the protective mode is so big somebody is really afraid to let it happen to go through that new door it's like there's a ex, 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 I'm, I'm afraid I'm, I'm really afraid um, but there's an opportunity for a major new beginning here. The lesson will be learned when you go through that new door. When you go through that new door, you will have learned a, a, a lesson. But see, it's, this world is over here. You have to deal with your illusions. You have to deal with your fears. You have to be practical. 
you have to ground yourself to make the most logical decision rather than the one that rather than letting your hurt hold you back Somebody deserved more than what they got with this person. They deserved more than this empty cup. And now it feels like there is somebody coming in that wants to make you happy, has something for you, wants to start a new beginning with you, But you have to come out of this period of of rest. You need to you need to allow it. You need to finally say, okay, I'm done. I'm done with this situation. I'm done holding on to it. I'm done waiting. We have an offer of love here that is real. But you're going to have to separate from the situation that is over here because you deserve abundance. You deserve this opportunity for security and stability. But you don't think you deserve it, but you do. Because whoever this person is that didn't follow through on their offer of love made you feel like it was you, made you feel like you didn't deserve it. But that's not practical. You are abundant. You're abundant. Don't let this person's lack of love for you keep you back, keep you down, keep you imbalanced, keep you unharmonious. Because there's an opportunity for love here. There is. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. Go ahead, go through that new door, accept that offer of love. So I feel like there's an opportunity for love here. Um, you were dealing with somebody in the past that was mean spirited and they you know they they couldn't they had no intentions of of following through unfortunately and i have to tell you i mean we have karma here we do with the justice reverse karma is truly a bitch it really is so believe in that there's no need for you to worry about it there's no need for you to hold on to it there's no need for you to stew over it any longer because Karma will take care of it. Karma's gonna take care of this situation. Okay? Don't don't you worry your pretty little head because karma's absolutely gonna take care of this situation. The person that, you know, hurt you. There's no doubt, okay? So now there's an opportunity to become alive and start a major new phase beginning chapter in a new direction there is lesson learned lesson learned I am worthy I am worthy and here it is oh <laughs> miracles and blessings everything has its gift this is a miracle. 
It is a miracle. Oh, goodness. It is. You are being given a miracle because you have persevered through some sort of separation that has made you feel less than worthy, but nurtured yourself back to reality. Now you have a major new beginning. Take a chance on love. When we start to love, our lives are changed forever. So it's time to let this love in. It's time for this big change. Take the chance. Don't let this pass separation from this person who, whose cup was empty hold you back. So that's my message for today. Go for it. Even if you're scared. It could lead to something very secure. Talk to you tomorrow.